I do sometimes dream of being in space. Sometimes I'll wake up and I'll tell Amico, hey, I had this dream I was launching on space shuttle or the space station. And sometimes there are people with me, like she's been with me in my dreams, my kids have. But in reality, while I'm up there, most of humanity is 250 miles below you. If anything goes wrong on Earth, you're not coming home. Now, last month, we launched a new space program that will send American astronauts to Mars. And in two months, Scott Kelly will begin a year-long stay in space. So good luck, Captain. We're proud of it. There's no sun on your face. You never feel this on my feet, this fire. You never feel this cold breeze. It's always exactly the same. It just makes me think of how long a year really is. I've seen him behind the scenes. I've seen the hard work he's put in. And here we are, and this is the moment. Space Station is a conglomeration of five different agencies, 15 different countries. It's the largest peacetime international project ever. It's a million pounds over the size of a football field, flying around the Earth 17,500 miles an hour in a vacuum. I remember wanting to be an astronaut from when I was a little kid. NASA is doing kind of a comparative study between my brother Mark and I since we're identical twins. I've flown four flights. This will be his fourth flight. It's just incredible. That's one of the challenging things about being away that long is just you're completely out of control. say problems happen at the fold of a map at the intersection of grid lines when something like this happens we just have to you know lean forward look ahead keep moving on it's important to continue to maintain our explorer mindset to continue to push our boundaries i feel pretty fortunate that i get to risk it all one more time <laughs>